In this session, we'll dive into creating a software bill of material document from an existing Polygot project, in this case a combination Java and Node.js project from Red Hat called Keycloak. There are numerous advantages of having a complete bill of material for your software projects, but we'll discuss those in future videos. We'll use the Cyclone DX bill of material specification, which is a lightweight bomb specification designed for use in application security context and software composition analysis. The project we're working on is a Maven project, which also wraps NPM for its client side compilation. So we'll start by creating the bomb from the Java dependencies. Ideally, these steps would be part of the project's POM, but for the sake of expedience, we'll call the Cyclone DX Maven plugin directly. Now, this will create a bomb from all the Java dependencies, excluding test scope, across all the Maven modules. Okay, great. So the first step is complete. Now let's create the bomb from the npm build. We'll start by running npm install, then we'll call the Cyclone DX node module to create the bomb. We'll specify the file name of the bomb we want to create. Now, if we just ran it as is, this would result in two separate bombs, one for the Java dependencies and one for the node dependencies. We don't want that. We want a single bomb representing the entire project. We could use a merge tool to bring them together, but the Cyclone DX node module includes an optional way of appending or merging in the results of other bombs. So we'll simply specify the file name of the Java bomb we created earlier in our results so that we'll have a single unified bomb containing all our project dependencies. Let's run it. And we're done. We now have a single bomb for our project representing all dependencies. Now let's import that in dependency track. We could use the Jenkins plugin, curl, or pretty much anything else. It's, it's just an API. Now that the bomb is imported, dependency track will continuously analyze the components in the project for being out of date, as well as for known vulnerabilities using multiple sources of vulnerability intelligence. If issues are discovered, the notification system in dependency track will alert you on various types of events via Slack, Microsoft Teams, email, or outbound webhooks, providing new ways organizations can collaborate and automate the response of various types of findings.